Hi all. Today we will be taking a look at a new injectable called Destroy Ref which has been introduced as part of the pre-release version of Angular 16. So as you are familiar with the ng on destroy lifecycle hook which can be added to any component, pipe or even a service by implementing the on destroy interface. So this is a normal ng destroy where I have added a console and when I click on this button basically I am toggling this particular flag and the child component will be destroyed and created. When the child component is destroyed this log message should be displayed. So this is our application. Now the child is created. When I click on the button again the child is destroyed. The message is logged. The same functionality we will be able to implement by making use of the new injectable that is destroy rough. So since it is an injectable we can inject it within our constructor and it has a method which accepts a callback. So here we can pass the same function that is we can call the console.log and we can comment out the destroy. So once we go back to our application you can see that when I click the console message has been logged. So why has Angular introduced this new injectable? So it is basically providing an alternative. We don't have to go in depth to the object oriented concepts like implementing the interface and we can directly inject the destroyer of injectable and directly access the on destroy method. We can even get rid of the constructor injection and we can inject this directly by making use of the inject function. So again this will have the same functionality. This way it will be more in sync with the functional programming. So hope you are able to get a good idea about the new injectable destroyer of. See you soon. Thank you.